hello youtube welcome back to my video in this video i'm going to show you how you can install postgresql a database and pg admin or postgres admin in windows uh, pc okay so i'll be demonstrating this one in, in windows 10 pc so the step is all same in all pc li like uh, if it's windows 7 or windows uh, 8 or windows 10 the steps are same so you can follow the same uh, step on installing that in your pc okay so to start the installation you have to go to the official postgresql website so to get uh, the website you can directly open this link postgresql.org or uh, just google postgres okay so this is the official website of uh, postgres just open it so uh, my pc is actually a 64 bit pc so if i'm going to properties i can get like my operation system is a 64 bit okay so this uh the step for installation is same just uh, shown you how mine is 64 so the further step will be i'll be uh following for the 64 bit pc okay so uh, once you get uh, to this uh link or official side you can see a download option here just click on download so it will take you to a page like this where you can uh download the linux version mac os version solaris version and windows version so we'll be going for the windows version just click on the windows here and it will further take you to uh, a page which will show you the all the supporting uh, versions and uh, the operation system which it is it is supporting okay so just click on uh, download installer directly so it will further take you to a page where you can select the version and uh, the OS which it is supporting okay so ours is a windows uh, OS and uh, mine is 64 okay so even for the 32 bit also the installer will same just click on download and once you click the download it will download uh, the exe file to start the installation okay yes so it's of 189 MB just wait for uh, the file to be downloaded installation file has been downloaded just uh, double click the file and so it will ask for your uh, user account control just click yes so uh, the setup wizard has been started just click next so it will ask in the installation directory i'm selecting uh, it as the default one and just click next now and now you can see here it will ask what all the things uh, to be installed so we'll be selecting all these so mainly we'll be needing postgresql server pg admin and the stack builder actually it is not needed let it install and the command line tools okay now click next and so it will ask now uh, the directory uh, to store your data uh, we are uh, keeping it as uh, the default one okay now click next and now it will ask the password for your database okay so i am giving it now as root r o o o t don't forget this this will be required uh, or while you are programmed to connect to your database okay so don't forget to keep it safe always okay now click next and now the default port number it will ask so port number let it be 5432 and uh, the local ID it will be default and click next and further it will clicking on next it will start uh, the installation okay this is the last step i guess just click next yes so it will take some time to install in install so wait till that and uh, the installation has uh, reached to a final step as i told we are not going to uh, get the stack builder you can uncheck it because stack builder is uh, taking to to uh, the advanced features of that for the basic uh, piece uh, postgres uh, sql installation you don't want to go to that installation okay now you can simply finish the installation here okay so once uh, the installation is finished you will be having a pg admin option here you can see here the app has been installed uh, so uh, just search in your start, men uh, start menu as pg admin so you can get the pg admin uh, uh, the quick launch here so once you click it it will show you with this uh, uh, screen here so it's uh, just wait for some time the initial loading will uh, take you uh, some time for that okay so it will uh, directly take you to the browser actually the pg admin is operated to the browser okay so it doesn't have a desktop application uh, so you can simply uh, log into your postgres database with your root password which you have given so mine is r o o t root and just click ok so you can see uh, the database uh, uh, again it will ask for password just 
okay uh, open here so you will have a uh, database named postgres and uh, this will be your uh, information of your database okay so we'll uh, go further into this pg admin and postgres database in further video so this means uh, this uh, section is showing your uh, database has been installed successfully and you have uh, successfully logged into your pg admin uh, through your browser okay so hope you got this uh, how you can uh, install pg uh, and uh, pg postgres sql and the pg admin uh, from uh, in, in a windows pc step by step so if you have any doubt in this please comment below i will try to help you and please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching